Salutations gaming enthusiasts, George Minot here, and today we're going to watch the Super Mario Bros. Wonder Direct! Yippee! Huzzah! Uh, I had at first thought to myself that I didn't want to really see anything else about this game before playing it, because I'm the kind I'm I'm that kind of person that likes to go into games and movies and things as blind as possible. Like I I will like watch the first trailer and I'll be like, yep, wanna see that or wanna play that. Any further knowledge will just lessen my enjoyment of the thing when I play it. But then they announced this direct and I was like, I'm not going to be getting this game for like three months. I'm going to be doing a let's play of this game, by the way. Heads up. Let's play of this game coming. I'm going to try and get a proper actual four player group together, which means I'm going to get, I need to buy little clip on microphones so that we can all be heard. Because right now I've just got like the kind that you have to hold. <laughs> Jeez, and that's not very ideal. Um, but yes, exciting. I didn't want to dodge spoilers for three months on this game. So here I am, ready to react to this direct. And it is currently 2.50. I'm going to watch it on my tablet here. I'm going to uh, capture the footage on my tablet and sync it up with the footage being recorded from my phone camera. That is, ooh, let me just give you a little, little behind the scenes here. Uh, I'm currently like, I'm resting it on top of this canvas. That's, that's Derwent Water in the Lake District nearby Keswick. That, that, I, I, I walked around that lake, it's a big lake. It was a, it was a nice walk, except for when I missed the last bus back to my holiday place and I had to spend 50 quid on a taxi. That bit wasn't fun. <laughs> anyway. <sighs> My family are really annoyed that I managed to f find a way to mention my holiday to the Lake District by myself in every conversation. Well, it's getting into my videos now, too. Anyways, yes. So, little bit of predictions before the thing starts. Um, predictions in terms of, like, other characters that they might announce as playable. Uh, the top that I'm wearing today is this one. It's a Wario-themed one. I'm trying to manifest Wario being playable. Uh, Waluigi, I feel very doubtful of, to be honest. But then again, this game is taking us all by surprise. It, it looks very unique and like it's doing some very new things, so who knows? So I'm, I really do hope that the different character, you know, with the, the, the elephant apple or whatever it's going to be called that Mario had in that first trailer, I do hope that the different characters transform into different animals. That would be very fun. <laughs> <laughs> that would be very fun. It would be great if all the characters had like different abilities as well. Obviously you can play as Yoshi and he has a flutter jump. It would be nice if they all had different abilities, but like obviously Mario, Luigi, Peach, Toad, they can just do what they could do in uh, Super Mario Bros. 2. When those guys are all playable in a game, they generally just have the abilities they had in that game. And that's easy to do, but like Wario, he can have a shoulder bash. <laughs> that would be fun. I don't know what Daisy could do though. Fun! Oh wait, didn't she in when she was she was playable in Super Mario Run on the on the mobile, which I have not played by the way, didn't she have a double jump? I think she did. That could be what her, that could be her thing, couldn't it? I suppose so. I suppose so. That's very very handy. I'm not expecting much from the story. I just hope that the bosses are not the Koopalings. I don't hate the Koopalings, but the kind of where creativity goes to die. Like there's a lot that New Super Mario Bros. DS did very right that I would like to see come back. Unique bosses being one of them. Another thing from New Super Mario Bros. DS that I wouldn't mind seeing come back is Mario vs. Luigi and all the mini games. Some good, like, competitive multiplayer would be good. I, 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 and also, like, there's online multiplayer. People have been talking about that maybe being a thing. Don't really care that much. This is the kind of game that I'm gonna wanna either play by myself or with, you know, friends in person. That would be much more fun. I don't think that it's that fun a game to play online, to be honest. No. Much more couch multiplayer. It does worry me a bit that in the, the little thumbnail for this direct they've got, they've got four different Yoshis in the thumbnail, and that, make, that makes me a bit worried. Like, they think that four different Yoshis are, like, just an acceptable four separate characters or something. <laughs> Which is a bit sad. Ah! Playable Wario, please. Please, Treasures and Garlic. He's, he's not, it's not getting, he doesn't like it, look like he's getting Wario, a new Wario Land game anytime soon. Please, let Wario be playable. I'm gonna be, how am I gonna hold this? See, the only thing, I, like, I do have a chair, 
But given where my phone is, um, and I can't really lower it because of the canvas, if I sit on the chair, this is all of me that you see. <laughs> And that's not very interesting for a reaction video, is it? Hello up there! <laughs> so I'm standing up. That's what I'm doing for my videos. I need to get a higher desk chair. That's just all I need to do. Like, one that's like twice as high. Maybe like bar stool height. Ooh, it's 2.57! It's almost time! Try not to shake the room too much, otherwise my phone will fall off of its canvas perch! Careful, George! Any second now. Any second, any second, any second now. They're late, it's three o'clock. It's not started yet. They're late, they're late. They're late for a very important date. It's starting, click. Ooh, oh. So exciting. It's quite exciting. <laughs> oh. Ooh, I thought it would call that. Flower Kingdom. The Mushroom Kingdom. Mario and friends were invited here by the benevolent Prince Florian. Huh. But Bowser, the king of the Koopas, had other plans. Of course he did. With just a single touch of the mysterious Wonder Flower. Should learn this in Sticker Star, Bowser. Don't touch strange things. Did he become the ship? Bowser merged with Prince Florian's castle. He becomes a giant castle ship? That is Bowser himself? My man's got turned into a building! Don't be racist, I am a building. Or would Bowser encourage you to be racist if he were a building? Good question. Don't be racist, I am a building. <laughs> oh no! His house got turned into a little prison! Well, it's pretty easy to avoid. They just need to not go in the house. Now, oh it's dear. Mario and Why was Mario smiling then? The oh, oh, there's Toadette there. Okay, Toadette's there. Oh, Nabbit! Yay, Nabbit! Number one Nabbit fan! Had a Nabbit and Luigi comic series when he was on Miiverse. We'll go over what's new in Mario's latest 2D side-scrolling adventure, the Super Mario Brothers Wonder Game. Let's jump in. It looks so pretty. The Flower Kingdom. It's made up of six distinct worlds that circle the Petal Isles, oh, six. making a total of seven areas to explore. Ooh, some question marky the areas there. Among the tubular hills of Pipe Rock Plateau. Oh, it looks so nice. It looks so, so very pleasant. Once you get past the freezing foot oh, of the mountain, I like ice areas. New heights in Block Puff Peaks. Looks like there's some consistency in the world. A lot of the time these Mario games, like, the levels don't, like, reflect, like, the world theme very much. Ooh, that's an interesting enemy. Shooting its nose out at Mario. Ooh. Armadillo themed enemies. Ooh. A scorching mm -hmm. hot Oh, he's carrying a pot of water! <laughs> Neat! <laughs> Ooh. Each world. Fire spikes! Move around the map in each world to select a course. Ooh. Okay. Even walk freely through open oh yeah, okay. It's it's like 3D world. Spaces. If you're not quite ready to take on a particular course, you can try a different one instead. Yeah, yeah it's like it's play like 3D in world. Order you like. In the in the uh, in the world map. Once you play oh, the course, nice. you can quickly come back to it through Ooh. the course's menu. I saw a little shopping cart like on the menu the screen. To play again. Cool. While in courses, you might notice some talking flowers. Yeah. Get like hint blocks in Yoshi's oh, Island games. How'd you get up here? What a pretty <laughs> sunset. They'll talk to you. Livening up your adventure. Mm. I wonder what Goombas taste like. They might give you hints. I wonder if you can get over there. Uh, or coins. You share your water with me? Aww. That's nice. Characters, yes. New characters? Ooh, ooh. Mario, oh, there's Nabbit and... Play as Luigi. Yeah, they see the different Yoshis as different characters. Bit naff. Hey, yeah, Daisy, whoa! Two toads. Oh my goodness. Toadette. Oh my goodness. They all play the same. Aw, so go oh, that's a bit sad. 
the Yoshis and Nabbit, on the other hand, okay, there's a difference. Damage. Oh, very great choice if you're looking for a more easy going Yoshi experience. as well. I'm glad Nabbit's here. Though, they'll still lose a life if they fall down a pit. Of course. So watch your step. Additionally, the Yoshis can flutter jump, eat objects, and spit <laughs> them back in. <laughs> Funny. Fun. <laughs> Speaking of it looks really weird when it's got in his mouth. Why is he pulling that face? Will copy the player Poppy cats. When you jump. There are definitely enemies like that in other games. Melon like Wall Eyes. Will spit seeds from their oh, a Melon Piranha Blitz! Oh, that's so whimsical, I love it. Condarts? Like condors. Oh, fun! <laughs> you, are you... Is she swimming through slime? Oh, she just stay still when she stops moving. Oh my goodness. They put Vor in. <laughs> oh, the little chipmunk guy. I wonder what the chipmunk guy's deal is. Oh, they do a, they do a little book bump when they walk into each other. Oh, the animations on these characters look so good. Ooh. Oh my goodness, they... Let's look at the new power oh my goodness, did they take the, the drill from Super Mario Galaxy 2 and make it into a power-up? Ooh! <laughs> okay. Alright. Fair enough. <laughs> Interesting. It's only showing Mario though. I do hope all the characters have... Other animals. I really hope so. Oh no, no. Elephant Luigi. Toad. What about Daisy? Show me Daisy. Peach, Daisy, and Jeez. They're all elephants. Okay, that's a that's a, a Show me Daisy! It didn't show Daisy! Show Daisy as an elephant. It's bubble, okay, fair enough. Oh, look at him panic as the bubble gets to him! That's kind of fun. Oh, I, I quite like the pink... I, I quite like the pink colours on the outfits. It's a simple looking power up, but like, it's nice. I bet the bubble, the bubble flower is gonna be... Like a new big important item in games. Okay, yeah, this is pretty nifty drill. This is just like Galaxy 2, but it's a power up now. Oh no, it's like the the shelmets from Mario Maker. Oh yes, yes, interesting, interesting, cool. Ah, that's nice. I like power ups that like make the level different and allow you to access different areas. The ceiling. Ooh, Excellent. <laughs> Terrific. Wasn't expecting company. <laughs> Plus, the classic I like the little quips. Of course, Five Flower. Oh, Daisy, you are perfect in every way. Oh, I want to see an elephant, though. In a pinch, oh. Oh, oh, little Daisy. Oh, hello. There we go, she's an elephant. Swap them to <sighs> the situation. She looks so bald. She looks so bald. <laughs> I get, I get that elephants don't have a full head of hair, but Daisy looks so weird and bald as an elephant. This is a wildflower, a uh. plant that grows in the flower kingdom. Oh, different colours. It's said they thrive off this world's mysterious power. Mysterious. And when it blew. That's now, the yeah, this is a sort... The wonder flower effect is something I'm very excited to see on every different level when I play it myself. So please don't spoil too many of them here, Nintendo, please. Causing some interesting changes. Pipes might start moving. <laughs> A stampede of enemies can appear. The terrain may tilt. So can Yoshi and Nabbit not become elephants then? That's my question. You can end up in a free fall. I want Wario. Oh, okay. Bubbles without the bubble flower. Oh my goodness, walking on the wall? That's interesting! Oh, that's great! Oh! Space! Cool! Elephant Peach looks kind of cute. Oh, Goomba Mario! So it's like he's captured it, but it's transformed instead. Interesting, interesting. I want to see Goomba other characters though. Yes! Oh, it, Mario's had inflation items before. <laughs> Wonderful. And the course will return to normal. Cool. Some courses need to be unlocked using the wonder seeds you've collected. 
Interesting. Oh, look, like a wiggler cut out there. You'll also earn a wonder seed as thanks from a poplin when you clear a, a course. poplin. That's the toad adjacent species of this game. Then, what does a little caterpillar prince guy do? I wonder. Badges. Ooh. As your adventure progresses, you'll unlock in-game badges okay. that change up the way you play. <laughs> I asked, and it was answered. <laughs> there are a variety of badges, each with its own special ability. I'm gonna have to pause Let's and read this a whole bunch. Slow your ball. I'll just watch Game Explain because they do that for me. Oh yes! Oh, that's a badge. It's not just like a special area. Ooh, wall climb. Oh, interesting. This is great. I love this. You can also break underwater. Awesome. Charge up. Crouching high jump. Yeah, that's like in Mario Bros. Two. Did the enemy just collect that coin for her? I think he did. Grappling. This is so fun. Oh, I can't wait to like find my like favorite badges and try them all out in different areas and stuff. That's so fun. That adds so many like so much more depth to the game. Oh yes. Become invisible to your enemies and yourself. Is that is that useful? I don't want to be invisible. I want to see where I am. You can't stop dashing. Oh, neat. There are many more badges with different e abilities. E e e e from the can you only do one at a time? I think so. Only one badge can be equipped per course. Thanks for the end. Thanks for the answer. Or when starting a course. Or if you don't make it through, grab a different badge and try again. Some badges can be earned by clearing special badge challenge courses. Oh, neat. Neat. Hey. While others can be purchased from Poplin shops. Yes, shops. I'm assuming purple coins, yeah, the purple, those, those, those purple coins you use, yeah, you. What about the regular coins, though? Do they ever use besides extra lives? Up to four people can play locally on the same Nintendo Switch system. Yep, yep. Pick I want Wario, though. And jump into the adventure together. None of these new characters here are exciting. I mean, I like... Okay. It's not a bubble anymore. Fair enough, I like the bubble more. Aww. Coward cheeks poof up. Oh yeah. Yeah. Aw, oh, fun. Fun, fun. Can you stack up four Yoshis on top of each other? Oh my goodness, poor Yoshi. His poor back! Oh. If you connect online, you might see other players on the world map and in courses. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, the, oh, the online people player. from around the world, enjoying the game in real time, appearing as live player shadows. Alright, I don't Just care for that. In local co -op, if you're defeated, you can come back to life by bumping into a live player shadow. I don't, I don't really care for that, no. No. Greetings. I'm gonna turn that off. I'm gonna turn that off. In-game items. Even though you won't be playing together directly, you'll mm -hmm. get to experience a subtle connection with Can you play together directly though? Enjoy this new adventure together. I don't I don't care for that feature really. No. You can also place a Looks cluttered and annoying. No. Standees can revive ghosts. So place them in not so easy areas and help your fellow players. <laughs> I'll use that as a not so easy area Just example. Any surprises from the Poplin shops to add more to your collection. You never know which standee you'll get. When you come into contact with an online player or their standee, you'll see their username and heart points. These I, points show how much they don't, other players on their adventure. I don't care about this. This sounds like a feature I'm gonna want to turn off. No. No. No, I don't me I don't care. Me don't care about that. You also have the option of Why am I talking like a baby? Me no care. Me no care. In a shared room, you can see which courses your friends are playing. Enter courses together and even race through certain courses. Start a race by hitting the race block. Oh, that's kind of fun. No, I, I kind of care about that a little bit. That's kind of fun. When you add like a reason for it, that sounds like the, an actual reason for doing that. Isn't the only way to I might interact with the racing in thing a bit. Fair enough. There's Bowser Jr. with his cool weird mask. Whether you're casually connecting with players from around the world, 
or syncing up with friends, mm. riveting races. You can enhance your experience. I feel like they don't understand the kind of online functionality that people want. <laughs> Big flipping flying confetti balloon fish thing. <laughs> Dear. Oh my goodness, there's so much to take in. Oh, look, Captain Toad, hello there. Show me Wario. I want Wario. <laughs> oh, elephants. I like the foreground background thing. It's very like Donkey Kong Country. Jump into the unexpected with Mario and friends Whoa! when Super Mario Brothers Wonder launches on <sighs> Nintendo Switch system October 20th. Plus, a new Nintendo Switch. Well, that's so boring. <laughs> I already have the red Joy-Cons because I got the Mario Odyssey Switch. Oh, it's got coins on the back. Yeah, that's... that's... Game software not included. That is... so unbelievably crap. Right! That was interesting. That special edition Switch? Very, very lame and stupid. What? If if it's to if it's released specifically for this game, I don't I cannot fathom why on earth they wouldn't include the game in that package. That's really really stupid. Like that's the kind of thing that I can see a parent buying for their kid and being feeling really really ripped off finding out that it doesn't come with the game. Like after buying it. That, that's a really stupid idea, that's dumb. Okay, but, just some basic information about the game. It looks good, it looks good. It's definitely not decreased my excitement for it. I was kind of, I was kind of hoping for much bigger things in terms of characters I can play as, but they just added Toadette, which has been playable in what, two? Like, if you count Mario Maker 2, then she's been playable in um, uh, New Soup uh, U Deluxe and Mario Maker 2 now. So she's kind of kind of entering into the realms of like regular playable character at this point. Uh, and you can play as Nabbit. I like Nabbit. I am probably one of the bigger bigger Nabbit fans that you could find. I did actually have a, I did actually make like a little comic series back on Meverse called Nab and Weege. And I'm happy that he's here. I'm happy that he's here. But again, again, we've we've played as him in two other games before already. Don't care that much. Yoshi? That's pretty good. Um, so, so does Nab what, did Nabbit and Yoshi not interact with the elephant? Elephant Apple, is that what it's called? I don't remember them saying the name of the item. Mm. But yeah, no, they don't, they don't transform into different uh, animals, which is a little bit of a letdown, but mm, I mean, to do that they'd want to make the power-ups look different. And it'd just be a bit awkward and weird when you got like several different characters and like go to the wrong one. It's like, oh, you can't do this one. I don't know. Whatever. It looks like a very good new 2D Mario game. That's what it looks like. Uh, it is possible that there are yet more characters that you can maybe unlock. Maybe after finishing the game, you can unlock more characters. Maybe there will be DLC where you can get more characters. I'm still kind of hopeful for Wario. Wario would be great. Pete, sorry, not Peach. Uh, Daisy already seems like a huge thing for Nintendo. Like she really does not seem like the kind of character. Like she's the she's the kind of character that has been um, just pigeonholed into only the spin-offs, like Mario Kart and Party and the sports games for such a long time. It does feel very strange and very very gratifying to see her in a more mainline Mario game. Um, but I feel like Wario. Wario, like, is more important and many of a Mario character than she is. He has actually been playable in a mainline Mario game already. He's been in 64DS, so it feels a bit weird that she'd get in before him and Wario is not anywhere to be seen. But, oh, oh well, I'm just, I'm just nitpicking. I'm just complaining here about something that I wanted to see but didn't see. That's not fair at all. It looks great. Very excited to play it. Please get excited to watch me play it with friends and whatnot. And hopefully it will go well and the capture card will work and the microphones will work and the USBs will work because one of the worst things ever is recording a fun gameplay session and then the footage didn't capture or something. 
But anyway, yes, that was Mario Bros. Wonder. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> hope you enjoyed the direct. Hope you enjoyed watching my reaction. Uh, let me know what you think of it in the comments. Let me know what you're excited about, what you may be disappointed about. Uh, if you're going to be getting it, when you're going to be getting it. Any reason you can think of is a good reason to comment, because give me that interaction. Uh, Super Mario Comedy Highlights video, two hours long, coming very soon. As soon as my thumbnail artist finishes the thumbnail. See you later. Good game. Good game. Excited about lots of things there. You can buy things. Badges. 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 Very fun. Excited. Excited. I'm really excited to play this with my friends, actually. It's going to be a great time. <laughs>